if we give it like 30 seconds, it'll be the right time. It'll be the time Ten. we are in this time. Ooh, in GTA wow. time, we'll be real time. And we can go outside and, and it'll be in the same spot where we are here and we can look out the sky and be like, holy shit, they made it, Whoops. they did it. Sorry. Oh, well, never mind. It's over. Oh, uh, we missed. We Damn missed. It. We missed the sync period. Dude, what are these people oh. do, still doing out at this time? Yeah, it's ten in the morning. It's kind of pathetic. Wait, is that is that Laszlo? Is he an You're actual popular. character in GTA V? I haven't yeah. played campaign in ages. He's got a he's got a radio station, and he shows up in some of the missions. This game had a campaign. Weird to think about, huh? Yeah. Honestly, I think Ballad of Gay Tony and Lost in the Damned was like real good. That's Bold. about as good as GTA gets for me. Bold. Lost in Dan was. Fucked up. That one has a dick in it. Yeah, it does. Oh, oh yeah. Gay Tony did. Ba sure Gay Tony gay. for sure had a dick in it. Yeah. How was it? I don't know. I didn't get to see it. I just know they made a big deal, and it's like, oh, did you hear about hot coffee? Yeah, well, we put a dick in this one. <laughs> <laughs> did you ever play or watch the hot coffee mod? Yeah. It was hot. Or Lukewarm coffee. Did you ever get a boner watching it? Two uh, fully dressed uh, three polygon character models. Just grinding against each other in different ways. Hmm. Let me oh. see. Wait. So that's just can you enhance? Girl can you enhance? Yes, enhance. I can. I'm not. Wait. Ass. That's just an ass. There's a. L oh, there's, there's balls. Kind of a thing there. yep. I saw a thing that said in Red Dead the testicles on the horses yes. shrink and grow depending on the temperature. Wow. So that's cool. We have too much technology. <laughs> Did you see the Batman Passion penis? The bat penis. You it should. was. It was okay. Yeah, it was what, okay. what do you mean it's okay? Uh, was I it? was expecting more. It what was is, just a silhouette of a dick. He's just a man. Should That's it, what makes him so powerful. <laughs> Should it be like scarred and battle worn? There's like no part of Batman that hasn't been fucked up because he's been fighting crime. So I'm going to say that most dicks look scarred and battle worn. <laughs> and if it's, it's circumcised, it's it's like it's the head. Scarred by it. even the head looks like it looks like the battering ram. Does his dick have little bat ears on it? Because he puts that on everything. No. Maybe we only got to see one side of it, and now we know he tucks to the right or whatever. It's it. Oh yeah! Every single time Batman leaps from the shadows and pins your like head down to the ground, it's like you're on the right left thigh. side. You're, you're like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everybody in this GTA lobby. We've been talking about dicks. What do we you're do welcome. when we get to wrecked, Master Wayne? <laughs> <laughs> what? Was that <laughs> Michael Caine? <laughs> <laughs> a tangerine. I can't. <laughs> can't attend. Where's the lease? <laughs> so the horse balls. Yeah. Do horses have one larger and one smaller ball? I feel like horses no. have enough of a gap that they don't have the same problem with humans, where our legs kind of like touch and. Uh huh. Because like with yours, your one is lower than the other one, right? Is that normal for you guys? No, no, mine are perfectly symmetrical. I've uh, I've been able to predict the motions of celestial bodies based off of uh. Geometric lines off of my balls. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's basically like a sextant. Um, these are references no one understands. Anyway, imagine somebody looking through this at my balls. That was the joke. Mm. <laughs> um, who wants, who wants <laughs> to play I'll first? I'll warm it up. I'll warm it up. I feel ah, like the guy that was doing ah, the testicles ah, thing ah, just had a bunch of pictures of dicks and balls on his computer, oh yeah. and then he had to like go back and say, "No, Ooh. I'm doing it because I'm making weather sure, yeah. balls." Sure. Yeah. So this is. This is essentially like a half pipe. You'll go up and then go back and then Got go it. back. Turn around. And there's like rockets everywhere car. and people are gonna shoot at you. Just turn around, just like a normal Perfect car. Landing. Would. Just like a normal car would. Just nail Almost it. there. Just like a normal <laughs> so yeah, so, basically you guys are gonna be crisscrossing each other, shooting rockets is all the Is the goal to are kill you? each other? No, it's a race. You have oh, to, where are you yeah. going? Where so, are the giant soccer balls? So why would I wanna go Fine. high? I uh, wanna go don't. lower. Yeah, you don't, basically. You just wanna hit the checkpoints and go back in. Got it. It's the same button to shoot rockets and use jets. Got it's it. Clicking in the stick. So yeah, that's. Ooh. Oh, it's accident. You're gonna boost whenever you shoot rockets, no matter what. Whoa. Oh. Oh. That's okay. I know you're just trying to boost. I that's, forgive you. Is there like a tumbler or something that collects, just egregious technology sins, like, like modeling uh, Ellen Page's vagina for no reason? <laughs> Wait, who did that? David, David Cage. Cage. Why did he do that? Because he had her I in mean, a video game, and that means he owns her. Kind of self-explanatory, isn't it? I think the first sex in video games I saw was Duke Nukem. Then mine would be, I guess, GTA Vice City? I was a late bloomer oh. with sex in video games. I used to tell my mom if I wanted a mature game that I was like, no, no, no there's, a, there's a safety mode in this Ooh. game where <laughs> the blood turns into paintball colors. Because I think <laughs> I'd seen it once in Goldeneye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mod. And then uh, some GameStop employee like called me out on my bullshit. Fuck that guy. I mean, would it have been better if the, if the dude was, hey, little kid, hey, little guy, you want to see some hot fucking <laughs> video that's games? Worse. That's way worse. You raise a good point. Don't yeah. worry. And he like, he like shoves you next to his hips. Like, don't worry. You and I, we're going we're gonna, to like run a game on your mom so you can see some hot video game fucking. Leave me oh, alone, mister. You don't want me to leave you alone, kid. You're gonna want to see this. I don't like- No! <laughs> Why are you still touching me? Yeah. 
Dude. There was another GameStop employee that one time I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna pre-order, I don't know, Halo 2. Yeah. And he's like, oh, did you play, uh, did you play Halo 1? I was like, Ooh, yeah. Ooh, he I, called you out, fake gamer boy. Yeah, I beat it. And he was like, oh yeah, what sure. difficulty? Nice. And I was like, I don't know, like, medium? He's like, well, if you want your game to last long, you should play hard. And then the car drive home, my mom was like, you know, you should play your games on hard. Oh, son. shit. And I was what? like, what the fuck is this guy's deal? Wait, your mom told you you should play on hard? Yeah, because she was like, I want you to get your money's worth out of your Hell games. Hell yeah! Man, your mom's a real gamer. You she should hot? call her and tell her that. Don't talk to me. Don't. No, James. Is she hot? On a scale of 1 to 10. I'm not going to rank my mom's just, hotness, I mean, no, no, no. Objectively. You obsess over my objectively. sister, so I don't want to no, no, get you No, I don't obsess over your sister. No, no, no. I just asked one time, I was like, let me see what her Instagram is. I said, let me see a picture of your sister, because I wanted to see what she looked like. And then Blaine got really uncomfortable with it. And then when I showed you a picture of her husband, you were like, I don't like the look. Look at this guy. Yeah, <laughs> he's an just, asshole. Okay. If you just showed me a picture, then I would stop asking. Yeah, listen, that's you can't do that to someone. You can't be like, like, show me a picture of your sister because the implications of your intentions. It's not okay. Mm. Do you have any pictures of your mom? <laughs> I just think it's not fair if you're not gonna have sex with us. <laughs> then we have to find someone close to you genetically who yeah, will. He's got a point. All right, here's my mom. Oh, we're not showing this to camera either. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, the, which one? The one yeah, on the top or the bottom? The one that's not a fucking infant in my arms, you idiot. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Alright, I can work with that. She's just, she's just a Texas... A, a Southern Belle. Would she, she care is. if I call her Blaine? Answer the question, Blaine. Yeah, don't avoid it. This is an improv show. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and. Know. Yes, and. This Whoa. isn't like on the spot, Blaine. Yeah, where you, you can just, just do... You can just refuse the premise. <laughs> Blaine, right, give us your And there's my sister. Chris. Yeah. Okay. All right. I see the resemblance. Mm -hmm. Is that your older sister or your younger sister? Older sister. You have multiple sisters. If you had to rank your sister and your mom, where, who would you put on... <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, it's just a simple question, Blake. It's really a simple question. It's pretty simple. If you want... All right, to make it even, you, you can look at both of our brothers and see which one you would bang. Yeah. Well, I know your, uh, your brother, Chris. All right, so He doesn't then, like me. No, what is doesn't. your... You have a brother? Yeah. What does he look like? Uh, a, a young, skinny Wilford Brimley. Uh, that's Ooh. pretty fuckable. <laughs> <laughs> the diabetes. So you're gonna go. So you're gonna you're gonna pick. A, I'll go with James's brother nice. over that on that one. Okay, good. Do you gotta tell your brother to hit the gym, man. Is that what counts for you, or do you or do you like tenderness? Uh, no, I'd, I'd I'd want muscle. Yeah. You thought about that. Like, if you were gay, what kind of man you'd want to be all with? The time. Yeah, yeah, nearly all the time. Yeah. It seems I mean, it will, like it'd be so easy. I already think about the dudes, like, celebrity dudes that I would already, like, oh, consider banging. Henry Cavill, Ryan Gosling, Army Hammer, I guess Hugh Jackman. These are coming out real fast, by the way. Do you, do you a lot of have a list where it's like, if you encounter, you know, like, your celebrity crush list, where if mm -hmm. you encounter those three men, you're allowed, you're to, have allowed to have sex with them, them and mm -hmm. it's not cheating. But, but, mm -hmm. so typically the list is, like, traditional intercourse, uh, penetration and whatnot. Mm -hmm. yeah. But, I mean, does it even count? Like, if Henry Cavill's in a bathroom and he's like, sorry, dude, I'm just so hung. And you're like, well, you know what? I, I can help out with that. And you just, you know, jerk him off a little bit. Yeah. Just a little friend dude thing. He's I don't, not in you. Yeah, I, don't, I mean, I he's in your palm. It's like it's, it's like shaking head. a hand. I don't think a list even factors into that. I don't think you have to like tell your significant other or anything. I think it's no. just expected. So if I gave a HJ to Henry Cavill, you don't think that Alana I mean, would mind? I think if you think pursued him with this specific hand that you touched his yeah. hand. I think if you pursued him uh -huh. and you said, I'm going to get into a situation where I'm in the same mm. shower yeah, stall yeah, yeah. as Henry, Henry Cavill and I'm going to uh -huh. jerk him off, then yes, you would have to tell your significant others. But if you were just somewhere, Mm -hmm. Showering, and he comes in, and his dick is out, Sorry. and it needs to be it, jerked, and you do it. That's not really cheating. No, I mean, just speaking for all women, it's the emotional <laughs> connection that mm -hmm. they're most afraid of being encroached upon. Yes, it's true. It's actually more feminist for you to jerk him off. It's come true. On. It's the most woke thing you could do. Yeah. I like tried to talk to Blade while he's focusing on the game. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, let's throw this the other way. Okay. Blaine. Yeah. Huh? You I, oh. and I, I know the answer. Mm -hmm. This is just educational, it's academic. If Alana ran into, I don't know, Allison Bree in the bathroom, quick yeah, approval of whatever. Yeah, whatever sure. no, okay, but that's different though. For men, it's different. It is different oh, for men. It's different. Man, I'm just, I'm just sick to death of, of women's double standards about mm -hmm. in chance encounters in the bathroom. Mm -hmm. Totally. What's the ugliest, ugliest uh, male celebrity that you would have sex with that at least would be okay with? Ron Howard's brother. Uh, Michael Shannon. Whoa, Ugly. Michael Shannon's a handsome guy. He's beautiful. I he's fucking not, love Michael Shannon. He's a Frankenstein the guy. Man. just <laughs> chews the scenery. Oh, shit, well, uh, let me try again then. Modern day Jim Carrey, does that count? Now, Modern yeah, Jim he's Carrey not really now. That, he, I mean, he's not ugly, he's just... He's yeah. turning into Fire Marshal Bill. Yeah, Which yeah, is yeah. a reference no one gets. Chris, what's the ugliest man you'd fuck? Uh, that... Hmm. 
Danny DeVito. You oh interesting. Oh, okay. Interesting. It'd be like fucking the Lorax. I mean, I think it would be a good story too. But it's you like know yeah. I mean, like yeah. there's something we said like I think I would lower my standards if I think it would end up with like Yeah, I like He's a cool dude, so I, you know. He's also been inside Rhea Perlman. What about Morgan Freeman? Would you have sex with Morgan Freeman? Are you saying he's ugly? I'd be afraid to injure him. Yeah, Why? True. He's not. Samuel Jackson's Mr. Glass. Oh yeah, you're right. Mixed <laughs> <laughs> up. Oh, nice job. God Fifth bless. Place. You're not playing dead all right. I figured it out like three quarters of the way through how to actually play this game. Oh, hitting all the buttons. Oh, yeah. uh, there we hit go. B, hit B. I love it. I love giving GTA to somebody nope. who doesn't. Just press it once. Oh, press oh, it. Oh, no. my God. Uh, Why are you? Trigger is go. You don't need to hold it. Why are you holding it? <laughs> no, a? don't go down. Don't go up in there. <laughs> hit B. This is awesome. Oh, I didn't, oh, I didn't even fucking check it. Unhit B. Whoa. Hit That's it again. Not good. B, when you hit B, it focuses on your next objective. Yeah, just tap it once. So tap it once. Oh. There, there you go. go. You're good. Oh! <laughs> you went to action mode. I like action mode. I can't okay. remember how to and change And you hit B again. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's because he's in he's in cinematic camera, so it's I, switching between. This is, no, no, this is how I like to play. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> hold on, why? Oh, yeah, hold, oh, you gotta you gotta see you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> I got through the entire Just release of Mission okay. Impossible Fallout without listening to that Imagine Dragons song while riding my motorcycle. Nice. Done with the friction. Fuck that you need. Man. Stuck in the middle. How did they? Man, that stunt where the dude like flies off the bike and then hits the ground and rolls. I that dude? You mean Tom, Tom Cruise? Cruise? He also ran over a woman, you know, with a car. He ran over a woman? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Tom Cruise in a bathroom. How much do you do for him? Well, I mean, he's gonna come over to you first. <laughs> Just make sure that's clear. <laughs> I feel like it'd be surreal, because he's like, a tiny guy. But I feel like he's got loads of charisma. Mm -hmm. Like, he's- he's he probably- He makes up for it. Exactly. He's seven foot five if you factor in the- the charisma. <laughs> Go back, Chris. Uh, Is it full it. butt penetration, or just a- a nice little handy. Do I spin on my palm first? How much do I spin on my palm? I gotta work all this stuff out so I don't freeze up in the moment, you know? Uh, so many people yeah. do that. You gotta yeah. practice. You have the conversation right. before you have to have the conversation. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Do you think people ever wonder how much spit they should use in their palm when they meet you? I think, no, and I wish people would think about it more. Cause one, one good spit, it's so variant, you know? I'm just gonna say you can't have enough. No, I mean you, you, you can't have too much. You want a me. little, you, you want a little friction in there, like that that song, <laughs> Mission Impossible song says. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> like, God, Chris, <laughs> I beat Mission Impossible <laughs> song. <laughs> Damn. When you were a kid, what did you use for lubricant when you were jerking off? Because you didn't, you couldn't have lotion. I, I well, a lot of times I didn't because I was like hiding it, you know. It well, wasn't until probably I had been masturbating oh, for no, years no, no, that no, I discovered. No, 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 what happens when you masturbate with lubrication? What do you what, what do you mean? What happens? I'm actually going to need this sensation difference huh. of being able to fully cover the shaft <laughs> and and dick head. I don't want to make this about me, even though I'm about to. Okay. I have I, I have yet to use any masturbatory aid of any kind, like any lube or anything. Yeah, I just never needed it. I never I could never imagine. It's not about needing. Uncircumcised, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheater. Sorry, the parents made that decision for me, and I thank them for it. It's hard for me to imagine it getting better than just like, than just how it is. But it, I don't know, that's such a, such a closed-minded way to approach the world. It is. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm a results-oriented kind of guy, so I'm like, hey, if I come, and I always do, like, within 30 seconds. Of course. Is it, hold on, uh -huh. is it better, do you think it's, it's more, uh, laudable, I think it's more enviable? To jack off fast or slow. I think having the control to do whatever you need is is the mm. most admirable. So trait. both in a given situation. So so if you can crank it out in 15 seconds. Yep. That's impressive. But yeah, it's yeah. even more impressive if in the moment you're like, I got 10 seconds before this cab gets here. Uh huh. I gotta wh whack this off in the in the alleyway. Chris, yeah, you're, yeah, you're, well, yeah. Your Uber's coming around the corner. Yeah. You, so you you're like, all right, I do it. I'll go. It's the same real plate. quick. Uh, and okay. so you do it. But Ooh. then it's like, oh, I'm by myself all weekend. Well done. And so Chris. you light some candles. Yeah. Throw and one leg you up set on the, the mood, table. and you wear a robe, and then you masturbate for eight hours or something. Like, mm. I think that's just as admirable. There's a time in college mm -hmm. where it's like I think my girlfriend at the time was like gone, mm -hmm. and I like girlfriend. Bought Sky gone. Skyrim. No, no, deflated, whatever. It, it wasn't Skyrim. It was what was before Skyrim. I like whatever. bought Oblivion and got a big pizza, and just like Oblivion pizza jerked off for like the whole week. All at the same time. Did you use All the, the same time. Yeah, Life, man. Use it's life, yeah. you know? And oh, so okay. she's got this condom, and then at the end of does the movie- Does it fit? Yeah, she, like, the she's the she's right, and it's no. like, no, well, it stretches <laughs> around his dick, or his dick doesn't fit in it. And at the end of the movie, she slides it on him, and she goes like, oh, it's you! And he's like, it is. <laughs> they oh. fuck with the condom again. <laughs> again they yeah. use it. After, after, she's, yeah. after she's put it on it's a bunch of other dicks. It's covered in hair, and 